Young woman named Brittany Maynard, who has reignited a debate over dignity and death, facing a terminal illness and an agonizing choice, taking her own life on her own terms. ABC Steve Osinsami now on the life, the death, and the very strong opinions on both sides tonight. 29-year-old Brittany Maynard made a choice to celebrate the last days of her life her way, traveling to Yellowstone with her husband and taking a boat trip through Alaska with her mother. My goals really are quite simple and they mostly do boil down to my, my family and friends. She always wanted to visit the Grand Canyon before she left this earth. She did that two weeks ago. Then this Saturday night, she met one last goal, taking her own life instead of seeing cancer destroy it. In her own words, today played over and over again online, she explains how her unbeatable brain tumor would lose and how she would win by dying in her own bedroom, surrounded by her family, putting an end to her pain and seizures. I had two in a day, which is unusual. And I remember looking at my husband's face at one point and thinking, I know this is my husband, but I can't say his name. She and her new husband, Dan, moved to Oregon for this reason, one of five states allowing terminally ill patients to end their lives with drugs prescribed by a physician. Her family says she died peacefully. Steve Osinsami, ABC News, Atlanta.